Hello! In this figure we have a square with each side of 7 units and 2 quarter circles. The yellow circle and the 2 quarter circles are internally tangent and these are the points of tangency. The yellow circle is also tangent to the square at this point. We need to find the circumference of the yellow circle. The formula for the circumference is C equals 2 pi r and r is the radius. So then, to find the circumference, first we need to find the radius. We know that each side of the square is 7 units and the radius of each quarter circle is also 7 units. We will start by drawing the radius of one of the quarter circles and let it pass through the center of the yellow circle. And because these two circles are tangent at this point, the line that passes through the centers of these circles will also pass through the point of tangency. Now, let the radius of the yellow circle be r. Then, because the radius of the quarter circle is 7 units, the distance between the centers will be 7 minus r. Now, from this center, let's also draw a perpendicular down and we will form a right triangle. Then, in this right triangle, the right side is r because it is the radius of the yellow circle. The bottom side is 3.5 because it is half of 7. And it is half of 7 because if we connect these two points, we will have another right triangle with the hypotenuse of 7 minus r and this side r. Then this side has to be 3.5. Now, in this right triangle, we will apply the Pythagorean theorem and we will write that r squared plus 3.5 squared equals 7 minus r squared. So again, I will write that r squared plus 3.5 squared equals 7 minus r squared. If we solve this equation, then we will find r. On the left side, we have r squared and 3.5 squared is 12.25. And now, to remove the parentheses on the right side, we will apply the formula for the square of a difference. The formula is a minus b squared equals a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. Then using this formula, on the right side we will have 49 minus 14r plus r squared. Now, we will cancel r squared on both sides. Then we will move negative 14r to the left and 12.25 to the right. Then we will have 14r equals 49 minus 12.25. Then 14r equals 36.75. Then we will divide both sides by 14 and r equals 2.625. Once we have r, we will find the circumference. The circumference c equals 2 pi times 2.625. Then c is exactly 5.25 pi or approximately 16.5 units. And now the problem is completed. Please subscribe to my channel, leave a comment and thank you for watching.